What's going on guys? It's me Pavin. And if you guys are looking to improve your Madden game and want to learn firsthand from someone who's made deep runs in the Madden $750,000 club championship tournament, I'm your guy. I recently just dropped my New York Jets offensive ebook and alongside that is my game plan for additional $10. So my offensive ebook is $20, game plan 30, game plan you get a couple defensive setups and I will be updating both these ebooks, both these game plans as the year goes on. Really great offer. The link will be down in the description. Go check it out, 818madden.com. I know this will make you a better Madden player. Yo, 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 what is going on, everybody? Welcome back to another video. In this video, we're gonna be playing Bobby V. Hashtag shout out Bobby V. And yeah, this is a weekendly gameplay. Let me know if you wanna see more of these. Um, currently, as I speak, this is a Sunday. I haven't finished weekend league yet, but I am 19 and 0. Hopefully, could secure the 25 and 0 back to back weeks. And yeah, I got a couple more Mutt gameplays on the way. Draft Champions is on the way as well. Um, the Madden challenge is actually going to start up next weekend. So I've been locking in for that, you know, slowly but surely. DC isn't the best mode, but we're going to fight. We always fight. So enjoy this weekendly gameplay versus Bobby V. It was a live com at the time I was streaming. You can always check out my streams, twitch.tv backslash Pavin Lakat, P-A-V-A-N-L-A-K-H-A-T. I'm always live with some weekend league whenever I play weekend league. Um, and you know, just a bunch of other content. I try to stream daily anywhere from, you know, three maybe two to you know five hours and you know that's that's that so like i said enjoy the live com gameplay reaction whatever it may be and i really do give out a lot of free game in that video shout out to bobby v again that's my dude and you know uh he's definitely you know improving each and every year and you know go give him a follow go check him out and all his channels he grinds pretty much more than anyone i know so yeah that's all that i gotta say i'll catch you in the gameplay Peace. Um, let's see what we got going on right now. Bobby V, tough. Very, very tough. Very, very tough. This is gonna be a good game, boys. I'm scared. I'm scared. Bobby V is a mutt demon. Aw, oh, shit. Here we go again. Mutt demon Bobby V. This is about to be a good game, to say the least. This is definitely YouTube gameplay. Can we put any on Bot Wars? Nah, I don't think Bobby would. Live comp chat. I'm not gonna do what's it called. I'm not gonna do a uh, music for the live comp. So here we go, man. All right, guys, we're playing Bobby V. Uh, this is a live comp. I am streaming on Twitch, twitch.tv backslash Pavin Lacotte. Check it out whenever. He's in bunch. You know, we're gonna have to rock that uh, 146 on him. Sherman right there. Rod Woodson should go up top. He's probably gonna audible out. He's probably gonna audible out because I'm not gonna lie, even I don't wanna play 146. So he's probably gonna audible out, run the ball probably. We'll see how it goes right here. Oh, good dot right there. He kind of, my zones weren't there. The motion in kind of made it to where my zones weren't there. Good dot right there. And if I had someone taller, I probably may have been able to pick it off, but I had Jimmy Ward on the lurk, which isn't the move. Bobby scared? Yeah, see, I told y'all he was gonna check it down. I mean, I'm fine with that. I still have Devin White. And I have Lawrence Taylor, Ricky Jackson with those double or nothings, Justin Smith, and then I have Deion Jones on the other side. Uh, I'm gonna have to call a timeout here, boys. That's the one thing about these audibles. It is kind of tough to do sometimes. It takes some time, but we're good, man. We're gonna get our audibles set and make sure we're good to go because we don't want to, you know, we don't want to sell. But before you hut, do you already know what will be open? Uh, <laughs> he said before you hut. That's how. Uh, it just depends, man, on, like, you know, my adjustments. Sometimes I know, like, oh, this adjustment's going to be bad. Oh, I know this adjustment will bag. So it's, like, a big difference. Oh, he's trying to roll out. I know this. He's going to block everyone. I watch Bobby stream a lot. He's trying to roll out. He got cheated right there. Um, I thought he was going to roll out. He ended up not rolling out. He ran the cover two play. I should have manned up the tight end. I initially had him manned up. I don't know if y'all seen I don't know what happened. I'm trying to rewatch it back. I ended up just manning up the slot. This is definitely a hell game. We both run Jets bunch. Running a cover two again, man. Uh, hopefully we could get pressure. And there it is. Pressure coach. He sent out all his routes. It's a big no-no, man. Uh, I like to block my running back if I know my opponent's blitzing. I guess obviously he didn't. He couldn't have known. And right here, we're going to run 146. I do understand, guys, that he is in, um, you know, What's it called? He is in 212, so he can audible down. But at the point of this, you know, if he audibles down on this down, I feel like he's wasting it down. I have three spies. 
and we're just going to be able to make that tackle coach and he's going to punt it right back to us shane leckler he got he got very unlucky on that first uh that tight end play to waller honestly he could be down probably getting three probably getting seven right now so you know we got a very lucky break coach pav yes sir you know the vibes man this is going to be a really great youtube video spread spreads demonic shout out the 225 in here if you guys haven't hit that follow hit that sub some good content coming on the way how do you spy your db so fast i use a uh, the uh double click i uh, there's a specific term for it i just can't think of the term um basically like you just hit y y twice and boom i'll make sure to tell y'all when i get back on offense uh right now we're obviously not even close to offense right there we're gonna throw it to derrick henry i tried throwing it earlier but i don't know why it just didn't let me um and we kind of got lucky not to get screamed at so we will take that man quick adjustments yeah you hit yy and you could quick adjust your uh cornerbacks pretty fast this does look like let's see this is a uh, cover three i want to say or match it's one or the other and it's going to be cover three we're going to pass you that outside very very thin window but we got the job done that's why you get yourself an aaron Rodgers coach that play right there is why i run jets playbook a uh, little mesh action man that that play mesh is really good right here we're going to run a little boot over and okay i'm just gonna run the ball because i have the numbers to the left side if you guys want to peep his co slot cornerback is on the right he hasn't flipped his bunch yet excuse me not his bunch i'm so used to saying that he hadn't flipped his um cornerback his defense it didn't really matter because we still got shedded but i mean it was still worth a shot to run the ball i forgot he has deflator okay you know what no we're not doing that we're not doing that we're gonna go on conservative because our dude is already tired bro holy snaps deflator man deflator I'm not gonna lie, I might just streak pass up to Isaac Bruce. It might be open, it might not be open. It wasn't open, we're gonna throw this ball away. Double or nothing got me pretty good right there. I had a touchdown to A. Wouldn't say touchdown, but a nice gain to A, but he kinda got a nice shed, we'll be fine. Right here, we're gonna run boot over, boys. Hopefully we get enough time to throw this crosser. Um, oh, we have a touchdown, boys, and there it is. Isaac Bruce up the seam, let's go basically right like what i just told you two plays ago he hadn't been flipping his defense so his slot corner was still stuck on the right side and due to that he ran a cover three and um that cover three basically means that his safety all the way on the right was the middle third instead of the safety on the left it's a lot of nerd talk but basically means that you know the streak was going to be wide open from the get i saw it a little late but you know late is better than never and yeah that's why i like like uh guys you guys should always 100 percent always flip your defense to match the numbers because it's, there's going to be a, a disadvantage somewhere he had three two to three guys on that left side uh two guys on that left side had three receivers so you know you do the math we have a plus one check out the ebook all this knowledge is in my ebook guys jets ebook you can cop it now 818madden.com link is in the description i'm gonna some more uh what's it called you know i'm gonna i'm gonna guard the tight end okay he, he's running the stock play we get that intentional grounding. Uh, I don't like the intentional grounding rules this year, but it is what it is. I'm used to it by now. Uh, in the beginning of the year, I would just lose my mind. That right there, I do personally think was intentional grounding, but we've all had that moment where like, bro, that's not intentional grounding. And they consider intentional grounding, but you know, it is what it is. Right here, uh, he's probably gonna try to roll out or pick, pick up the blitz. We're gonna try to jump to the right side. Good, good dot right there. If we can make a tackle, I'll be fine with it. Um, I'm blitzing heavy now. Honestly, I should have probably played coverage right there. He's he's catching on to my tendencies. We're going to switch it up and run match. Um, let's see if he likes match or not. It's always good to test your match out. And the thing I think he's doing is he knows... Is it, if he knows this is match, then he has a glitch. But uh, go playmaker dot. What happens, guys, if you motion that running back to the left, sometimes a match really doesn't activate. Um, because you have that extra guy to the left. And the defense, for whatever reason, accounts for that. Um, I don't know if he knows that. That's just something I know. So I'm just going to take that into advantage next time I run match. Because right off the bat, I was in match, and he motioned that guy out. So we'll see. Right here, he's going to probably run the ball. I'm just going to spy my safety to be safe. And, you know, I'm fine with that run play. Two-yard two game. Yeah, it's just, I don't know. It's just a plus-one game. You know, that's simple knowledge. Just take advantage of that type of stuff in the future, guys. Right here, simple coverage. Okay, he's motioning that guy out. Um, I'm just going to have to... Okay, that's fine. That's a good bag, man. Let's go. Oh, my God, make a tackle. That's fine. Right there, double or nothing. Just went crazy. Ricky Jackson with the shed. 
We get the fumble, coach. And you know what this means. We're going to run 146 on third down. And like I said, if he wants to run the ball, be my guest, man. Um, if I give up the yards, I will never be mad. But the thing is, it's very hard to get that in this year's game. It's just, I don't know, man. It's just, there's, there's so much speed out here that it's very hard to pick up these uh, third downs, fourth downs by running the ball. Last year, maybe. We can't get on our guy. We are going to be able to bag up, coach. Watch the playmaker. Acrobat. We get the pick, but it's out of bounds, but we'll take it. It's going to be a fourth down. Pop Romo, man, just wait until we get that equipment set up, bro. It's going to be next level. You, it's, it's actually stuff you'll never, you've never seen before, bro. Planning on get like, iPad circling down my reads, like, with a pen and the, you know, how they do, like, the NFL analysis. Some some glitchy stuff like that, man. Football and Madden, they, they're the same thing, bro. Right here, once more, guys. Run in, one, four, six. Here is the setup. I'm going to hit this guard, and due to that, I should come in, should come, be able to come in free. Um, he blocked everyone. We fell down. Justin Smith, great dot right there. I should have set my zone drops. Um, I re really messed up my coverage and everything. And honestly, guys, uh, if I were him, I would have no huddled right there because I, I was in one four six. So if someone is running one four six on you, like on a fourth down, and you do convert it next time, just no huddle and make them pay for running one four six. Make me use a timeout, man. That's what I was hoping he'd do. He threw it away. He had a dot. Uh, I think the pressure was a little too much for him. Once more, he's motioning over this running back. I'm telling you guys, if he knows, then he might know. But honestly, that's a bag. He does actually get a good gain right there. And that's the thing about having these linebackers. Sometimes they really just don't guard anything, guys. This has actually been a pretty good drive. Cover three beater out of bunch. There's a lot, man. Mesh is one of them. We're going to send the heat, guys. I think he's getting a little comfortable back there. Uh, we just got to make some adjustments, man. And that was weird. I don't know if you guys saw. I had double contains on the right. Hopefully, we could screen, man. It would be nice. I'm guarding the right side by myself. And we are going to get pressure, coach. Let's go, Nambi. Awesome one. 99 speed screaming off that edge. Right here, guys, running man-to-man -man cover, shade out, shade underneath. Trying to guard the tight end. Watch the playmaker. Send the guy, and boom, that's a cage. That's a cage. That's a cage. Third and 20. Right here, guys, I'm honestly, I want to run 146, but I'm thinking about just running the same defense we just ran because he can run the ball, get a couple yards, and get a field goal at this point. You know, if he does end up getting a first down on third and 20, that's on me. I'll take all responsibility. But, uh, you know, if, he, if we hold him to three, I'm fine with it. You know, basically what I'm saying is if I ran 146, he'd probably run and he'd probably be able to get an easy first. Right here, Ricky cracks in, coach. Goes actually nuclear. And that's the one thing about motioning your running back to that left and right side. Um, that guy on the left, the blind side guy is going to come in free. And that's really just what happened. So, you know, we'll take that stop, guys. Ricky Royds, coach. Uh, great defensive stop. If we could get even three right here, we'll be set. And he actually punt dots us to the one, bro. Not the one, excuse me, the four. That looked like the one, but still pretty, pretty effective. We're going to have to be on our toes and watch out for any type of blitz threat, guys. Yeah, mid blitz is pretty good if you have the right abilities. I want one, four, six, uh, French print, fresh prints. Right here, going to run spacing switch. And you guys know who I'm looking for. I'm literally just looking for Derrick Henry right here. I am on conservative, so we're not going to be able to... Uh, psych, we changed it. I, I don't know when I changed it, boys. I don't know. I guess I changed it earlier. Uh, I, that's weird. I'm on conservative, but I trucked. That might be a glitch. We're going to call timeout, boys. Um, I swear, I knew I was on conservative, but I still trucked just to do it. And it, for some reason, I was able to truck. I never knew you could do that, boys. We'll definitely have to try that again. I don't feel like throwing a table out right here. We're going to run bench pivot Vernon Davis. Hopefully, we get enough time. Um, he has doesn't have contains. We're gonna roll out throw a dot Nambi can't get there He can't actually get there, but he hits us defensive pass interference. will surely take that first down move those chains. Oh That's still glitchy then that's glitchy, bro uh, Deep out KOs is really good Right here. He's been running a lot of cover three and so you see now after that first initial um, Touchdown we scored he's flipping his defense flipping the slot cornerback Looking for this out route right here. We could pass that up. Really nice play. Right here, guys. Going to run mesh. I have my playmaker on the solo side. I don't even know what he's doing on his defense. He's kind of readjusting them, guys. And we're just going to throw this ball away. We had a couple guys in the vicinity, so it's not going to be intentional grounding. I had a... I think I had mesh wide open, but his zone drop was kind of weird. Uh, I like to run that play, but a lot of people know it's coming, so I don't really run it. Yeah, this is weekendly. We end up matching up. 
Shout out to 300 in here, man. Means a lot. Ice, casual ice cream truck. Hopefully it works. Playmaker up. Boom. Good dot. Aaron Rodgers, flick of the wrist. LFG's in the chat for Optimum Prime. Appreciate that, my guy. Much love. LFG's in the chat. Like Right here. We're running boot over, but we're running a different setup because Marvin is already on a drag. I'm looking for this tight end crosser slash the out route. And really don't have anything. We're going to playmaker up. Throw a dot to Vernon Davis. Let's go, man. Great pass right there. 22-yard touchdown to Vernon Davis on the crosser. And, yeah, that's what happens when guys run a lot of cover three, a lot of zone. Just easy dots all around the field. Uh, if he was a man, I probably would have been able to throw that still. But, I mean, it would have been a much harder throw, man. And I have gone picked on that. That dot also is in the ebook. Go check it out, man. Exclamation point ebook in the chat. For my D, I run three one steps ahead inside stuff. Pick artist. That's pretty nice. I like that. Right here, we're going to set up our zone drops, guys. Uh, I'm going to put 25 flats, 10 curls. And I like having the flats on the more, like, longer depth because sometimes if you have a curl with that, um, sometimes it just gets sucked in the inside. It's weird. But I, I, you guys have probably seen it. Curls kind of go dumb sometimes. They go to the middle of the field. They honestly do whatever they want. Right here. Deion Sanders, acrobat, inbounds, baby. You got to love it. He had that dot a little earlier. He waited just a second. And Dion goes crazy, and that's why Acrobat is a necessity. Um, if I didn't have Acrobat, I wouldn't even got close to picking that off, I want to say, guys. And, you know, right here, if we score, this game is going to be ball game, bro. Right here, going to run Flood again. He's running a lot of cover three. This play is really good versus cover two, cover three. Hopefully, we can hit it. And he is in cover two. We're going to pass it outside. And like I said, we thread the needle once more, man. He has Acrobat as well, but there's just... If he picked that off, man, then... Oh, my God. I don't even know what to say, boys. Acro definitely went crazy, man. Same play again. Um, I don't have that much time. So, as you can see, I'm going towards the sideline. This play not may not work because it is a little uh, too inside. But right here, he ran cover two. And that's what we've been waiting for, baby. They run cover two. You hit that outside pass lead. It's a nice cover two bomb. And we're going to go up 21-0, man. Jets playbook is a beauty, man. It's a beauty. Yo, guys, uh, that wasn't the best gameplay that Bobby V played, but I did give out a lot of free game, and, you know, I would feel like that gameplay would have gone to waste if, you know, I didn't decide to post it. So once more, shout out to my dude, Bobby. We all have those bad games. This is no different than, you know, one of my bad games I've had. And, you know, you could really tell he, he wants it more than anyone. So, like I said, go give him a follow. Go give him a, you know, shout out, whatever it may be. Uh, but go support him because I 100% fully support him. He's a great guy. And yeah, he's on, he's on the come up, man. He's definitely on the come up. If you enjoyed this video, please hit that like button. Sub, share, comment, subscribe. Um, I already said sub. But, you know, sub for that bell notification so you get all the latest updates on when my videos are going live. Till next time, boys. It's your boy P. We're signing out. Stay safe. Stay smooth. I love you.